What's up guys, welcome back to Oz Europe Feeling, it's Connie here. Don't mind the hair and me, I legit just woke up. Got all the light cages on because they're on thermostats and whatnot. You know, all that stuff. It's the morning, well, it's my birthday, it doesn't really matter. But, I am going to Melbourne to meet up with Jake from Aussie Reptiles. We are going to get a package of lizards, and yeah, so let's get to it. Connor's just got his. What do we have here, Connor? Uh, this is a albino 100% hit viper. That's pretty good. I wonder what Chris got. Me too. <laughs> so Lockie's here as well. Everyone's here. I know, right? Uh, if you can see, it's an iPhone 7. Go okay, for a shirt. It's an iPhone 7. I hope the camera recording is like much clearer than my old phone. What not. So... As you saw in the last video, that's Edna's old enclosure. There's Edna right now, she's, she's about a shed. Um, and then in that enclosure was the blueies, but I put the blueies in a tub down there. And then, yeah, so I've got some special animals here, here, and two in here. So, let's get to it. I would like to thank Chris, Pete, and Brayden for these baby blotchies. They are not just your average blotchies that you find around your house or whatever in Victoria. These are Flinders Island locality blotchies. Got these bad boys today. There's one. They're just so small. <laughs> Where's your little buddy? There you are. <laughs> that took a little while. But yeah, I've got two baby Flinders Island blotch blue tongues. If I can, with the new editing app, I will chuck some photos up of them right now. If not, you won't see them. But yeah, two baby Flinders Island Blotch Blues, I am super duper happy about these because the Tasmanian, because these are classified as Tasmanian Blotches, they are pretty hot, like they're very uncommon in mainland Australia. So I'm very lucky to get my hands on a couple of these and they won't be going out into the pits just yet, only because they are so bloody small. But yeah, thank you Chris, Pete and Brayden for that. I really appreciate it. So let's get to this. I would like to thank Joe Ball, the man himself, the bluey breed, the best bluey breeder, whatever you'd like to call him. Hey, calm down. Um, since today was my birthday, I asked if I can get my lizards freighted down today. And as you can see, there's one there. There's one over in this corner, don't bite me please. So I've got two of these lizards that I hope that will prove out and I will produce probably my favourite morph in the whole world which is a lava blue tongue. A lava blue tongue is basically a hypermelanistic albino. So the hypermelanistic is a black blue tongue. You breed a black blue tongue 
with an albino you get double hits 100% double hits and then you breed the double hits together and then you get the visual and whatnot as you can see these guys are they're pretty interactive this one's very skittish that's all right this one is very 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 dark which I absolutely love and they are all Kimberly I they're a mix of everything but I love them so these are two possible double head lovers um, yeah they are they even if they don't prove out that is absolutely fine because they just look amazing like they are just beautiful lizards I can actually throw over in that corner there but yeah so I've got two possibly double head two possible double head lovers right here hey buddy one's drinking and now for the finale probably the best animal in my collection by far right now another thanks again Joe Ball for sending this amazing animal it is just absolutely beautiful and let's get to it I actually just took the lizard out um, but yeah it's just a little simple setup with a hide fake plant from reptile one go check them out they're awesome just a little water bowl I've got off eBay and a rock a 60 watt basking light and just a thermostat set on 30.4 degrees so let's get to this animal three are oh, you a little bit dirty buddy hey hey you're all right three two one wow look at him or her i don't really know yet basically this here is a come here buddy this is a visual albino blue tongue I've been wanting one of these for years now a good two two and a half years now and since it's my birthday I saved up all my money this year and mum and dad helped me out a lot with this purchase but, uh, yeah this is my albino blue tongue 100% het hyper so that's the black so I'm hoping those heads right there turn out to be double hair. I breed this to them or they breed this and then I will be able to make some larvas which would be absolutely incredible but as you can see this lizard is just incredible in my eyes anyway some people might not like it that's just them but this lizard is just <coughs> amazing oh, yeah. I'm sorry, I'll, I'll wake you up. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, okay, okay. I'll put you back now, buddy. But I was hoping it's male to breed with these double heads. But in my opinion, I reckon this is a female. And then that head there is another female. And then the other one is a male. Which is pretty good odds. But that's what I'm hoping anyway. This is my albino 100% het hyper blue tongue off Joe Ball, the man himself. And also, I'll... I would like to thank Aussie Reptiles, Jake, as you may know him as well, Jake from Aussie Reptiles. He also came and picked up a couple of lizards and, hey, hey. he just had a little... Okay, okay, you do you, you just wake each other up, oh I've got a little pancake, but yeah basically I'd like to thank Jake for coming along as well, he picked up some amazing animals as well, but he was there for my birthday and I really appreciate it, um, yeah so go check Jake out, uh, make sure to like and subscribe and stay tuned for the next one which would probably be tomorrow about this bad boy. So, see you tomorrow.